Hi, I'm Gary White for Central Kentucky Television. I'm here with John Sparrow, who is with Marion County Adult Education. And we have some updates on some changes that are going to be occurring for the GED program starting in January of 2014. So can you tell us a little bit about these changes that are coming our way? Yes. One thing is going to be all computerized. If you don't know anything about a computer, you really get to need to be familiar with it, how to type on it. Also, I'm a two-finger typer. So if you're like that, you better be either quick or learn how to do it with all your hand, all fingers. Okay. And you have to write, do essays on the computer and type it. And there's going to be some open response questions where they're going to ask you for an answer where you have to actually type it out, not just A, B, C, or D. Okay. So it is going to be a little bit more difficult. The math, they're adding some calculus and trigonometry. Not much, but a little bit. You're going to have to know more about that. Okay, now this is for the GED program, but right now as we're recording this, in August there is an opportunity to take the test that has been in existence for the last 11 years now, right? Yes, the last 11, well, since 2002, mm -hmm. the test has been the same. So for 12 years, at the end of this year, it'd be in effect, which is longer than most tests run. Now, this, this test, if you've done anything at all in the past some of the subjects are maybe you only like one subject to pass please come in do it now because once it changes everything goes back to zero and you have to do the whole thing over okay. if you haven't done anything come on in let's get started now because there's a process that the state requires an assessment test in which you have to do well on it then a pre-test and then the real test right now the test costs sixty dollars unless you're on any kind of federal assistance and then community action will give you a voucher for that. But it costs sixty dollars now, the new test a hundred and twenty. So because it's computerized they've upped the price on that. So it's best to get in now and get this taken care of. And I've got a few things here about that. Uh, first I'm gonna brag on ourselves a little bit. Okay. Uh -huh. We were ranked number two in the state out of 120 counties for the adult ed program last year. Now, does it mean we had second number of GEDs? That means based on the criteria the state set for us, we more than met that, mm -hmm. which was very good for us. But that means we can help you if you'll come in. Now, we have two centers. Obviously, the one here at 214 North Harrison Street, and our phone number here is 692-2266. Well, there's also a center behind Walgreens at 102 Hamilton Heights. And that's the Family Literacy Center. If you have a child that needs to be taken care of during the day while you study, they have a person there that can do that. Their phone number is 692-1253, and that's run by Martha Spaulding. Mm -hmm. Okay. So there are the two opportunities for the Marion County Adult Education. And again, the testing, if somebody were to come in today, would they be able to complete the process before the end of the year? Most would, not everybody. I've had people that's taken more than two or three years to do this, and some that's come in and by two or three weeks, they're ready to go. Okay. It depends on where they are in what they already know. Right. Yeah. And as uh, John mentioned, if you have started the process and you have completed a certain element of it, you need to complete the rest of it by the end of the year or else you start back at zero. Right. At zero, and I've had that, I started in 2001, and when that test ended, I had some people that were one point short but had to go all the way back to zero and start all over again. And some people get discouraged when that happens and won't come back at all. Right. And the price increase as well is going to double in price. Double in price. And again, I don't know how Community Action is going to look at that double in the price, if they will pay it all or only part of it. That's going to be up to them. Okay. So come on into the Marion County Adult Education Office, either here or at Hamilton Heights. Get the process started and get your test completed, hopefully, by the end of the year. Hopefully by the end of the year, because we can help you, but you have to show up. Now, you have to put forth the effort. We're not here to, you know, babysit you. We want you to do the work, because once you get on the test, nobody's going to be there to help you. It's going to be up to you. Right. And what is that phone number one more time with questions? The phone number here the for phone one phone number is 692-2266, and at Family Literacy, 692-1253. Thank you very much. Thank you, Gary. I appreciate the time. It's been Gary White for Central Kentucky Television.